Welcome to Addicted to Real Estate TV. On today's episode, we're going to talk about health before wealth. So stick around, I got a lot to teach you. To say you gotta know somebody, or know somebody, to give somewhere these days. To say you know that's alright, yeah that's alright. Okay, today's episode is going to be one of the most important videos I've ever made. And we're going to start with showing you some of the stuff that I eat. Anybody know what this is? Tomato, apple, no. It's a pomegranate. And we're going to start with this. First thing you do to make a pomegranate shake, which is what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a pomegranate smoothie with some other things you probably never thought of. The first thing you do is you take a bowl and you fill it up with water. Nice big bowl. Get out a cutting board and a strainer. Ah, uh, heck with the cutting board. Somebody stole mine. Cut the top off, like so. You make a cut in here, X pattern on the top of the pomegranate. See that? All right. Then what you do is you face it towards your bowl of water and you rip it apart you can take a look at what it looks like inside look at that sucker okay these berries are the gold you want to get these berries into your drink the reason you put them in water is because these suckers they bleed all over the place and they're nasty they get all over the place and uh, you get it on your hands and on the countertop and on your clothes and everything else so when you use a uh, bowl of water, which is a, what I've learned from actually watching other people's TV shows, um, not just addicted to real estate TV, but other people's health TV shows, this yellow part, this, I don't know what you call it, this padding, this filler, this garbage, you don't eat. This is not edible. All right, so you chuck this stuff. What you want is these kernels. These kernels, kernels are the gold. You want these suckers, they're filled with juice and with all kinds of amazing properties in there for you. So what you want to do is you want to get the juice. Uh, we're going to put these kernels into our blender behind me and we're going to mix up a drink. Okay, so you're probably wondering what does uh, making this uh, pomegranate smoothie have to do with real estate? Plenty. What good is it to uh, make millions of dollars in the real estate business if you're dead? Not much. You have to apply health at the same time you're applying your wealth building strategies so that you can actually be around to enjoy the wealth that you've obtained. So what you do is you get this, uh, this filling portion. You gotta kinda get it out. It floats to the top. So if you mix it up a little bit, most of it will float to the top and you have to clean it out. This usually takes about uh, 10 minutes or something, it's not a big deal. And uh, you're preparing these kernels, separating these kernels, preparing the kernels to go into your blender. So I'm almost there, I got it pretty clean now. Now I'm going to dump the water and the kernels into a strainer. See how many you get from just one pomegranate. That's a hell of a lot of kernels in there. Okay? So, that's just one ingredient. Let's see what else we got. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> this is a gigantic 
aloe vera leaf. And we're going to put this in the drink. That's right, people. We're putting aloe vera in the drink. So, I'm going to take off this sticker here. Get this out of here. This is a magical ingredient. And this part here, is nothing wrong with it. It's just, uh, this is where it got cut off from the plant. So I'm going to sort of cut that off. And you can see what it looks like inside. This is the gel. This is the gel right here. You can wipe this on your skin. You can eat it. I'm going to take a nice hunk of this thing, so I'm going to take a nice big piece. That is a very big piece. I recommend if you're trying this for the first time, don't eat a piece this big, but I can do that because I'm, I'm used to this stuff. And you can see what the gel looks like. It's solid, but it's very gooey here. You can make a little lip balm out of it. You can put it right on your skin. It's kind of bitter tasting, but uh, I'm used to it. You can also, you could just chuck it in a blender right now. A lot of people do that. But since I'm making this video for you people who aren't familiar with this kind of eating, I'm going to cut off the spines. There's like these, these spines on the edge of it. And I'm going to cut them off. And now you can see, it almost looks like a little sandwich. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my knife in here, in between the skin. And quite often I just chuck this right in a blender. Uh, with the skin on it and everything but it does make it taste a little bit bitter so if you kind of peel this back get in there with your knife the shape of this thing is sometimes makes it difficult to peel it you get in here and try to save as much of the aloe as you can and so we got <clears throat> a little bit on here, I'm just going to carve off and put it right in the blender. I want that goo in there. Got a burn on your skin? You can take this, just rub it right on there. It immediately gets absorbed right into your skin. This stuff is like magic medicine. A gift from, from God. you rub it on your skin, it gets immediately absorbed right through your pores into your bloodstream. Usually this is easier to get the skin off, but I used a part of the leaf that had some crazy shapes on it. It's just making it take a couple minutes longer. You can see how big it is. This is probably a lot for beginners. They would never put this much in. They put in like a quarter of this, but I can handle it because I like this stuff. So you can see how big it is. Nice big block. All right. That's the hard part. Next, we're going to put in some.
All right. Next, we got another secret ingredient. Frozen bananas. Bananas make for great smoothies, an essential element. And it works much better if it's frozen. inside them. Gotta get rid of that sucker. There's one. Two. Three for good luck. One more for good luck. Usually I only use two. Three. That's out of here. These are also pretty sweet. They're Turkish figs. You can just chuck them right in there. They got a little stem on them. A little hard. That's those suckers. Just a couple of those. Chuck them in there. What do we need? What else we got over here? What else? We're good. There it is. So we're going to put some water in it. How much water? I'm going to put in, I don't know, a cup and a half, two cups. Who the hell knows? The bananas are frozen, so it's going to make it nice and cold. You can see how much water is in there. Alright, and this magical drink is ready. This is a special blender called a Vitamix. You take this lid off of it, and you have a plunger that can plunge it down. So let's get started. Dinner is served. <sighs> Tastes like a milkshake. It really does. No fat, tons of vitamins, tons of minerals. Pre-digested for you since it's blended. It just uh, goes right into your body, gets absorbed into your bloodstream immediately. This is a great meal. Health before wealth, people. Start eating smoothies. I'm Phil Falcone from Addicted to Real Estate. Get yourself a Vitamix blender. Start reading some books and learn about this. Adios, amigos. <laughs>